Morning everybody! Is it still morning? I'm not sure. Wasn't actually planning on filming anything today, but look. we're having quite a nice day at home. Look. So Have what? A look. Go on then. Are you doing one? And um, which pot does that go in? No. Which colour's the same as that dinosaur? Yeah. Yeah, so we need to put it in that one, don't we? Yeah? Clever look. boy. And um, which one does that go in? Have a look at your colours. Nah. Which one? Which one of the pots? Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, good boy. Can you say purple? Purple. And what colour is this? Green. What? Green. Green? <laughs> you just told me it was blue a minute ago. No, green. It's not green. This is green. This one. Yeah? This is green. Anyway. Uh, we're having quite a nice morning at home. It's actually oh, 10, oh, 17. Oh. oh, wrong one. Uh-oh. I feel like I've been up for absolutely ages this morning. I've been up, we've been up since half seven, which is the usual for us. Just ignore all the mess behind me. It's just life this morning. <laughs> but yeah, we're having a nice morning this morning. We are staying at home today, obviously. Well, I say obviously, we've not actually had a day at home just me and both the boys this week so I was so ready for it I got a bit emotional last night I don't know why well I do know why because it's that time of the month um as I found out this morning uh so like last night I got we're getting so emotional about Jesse I don't know I don't I don't know I was just getting really upset about him I don't know why like I don't know and then I got in my feels about having to go back to work and things I thought I was feeling all right about that we're far off that just yet anyway I thought this time I would be stronger going back to work because I've done it once with Jesse uh, but I don't know now but yeah I, I just really wanted a day at home with them both I was going to take him to soft play but I've just decided to stay at home because we love it Teddy is currently upstairs having a nap so honestly my boys are so different <laughs> I don't know if the personalities are going to be different when they're a bit older let me just go and get my tripod but in terms of sleep and napping totally different so with Jesse he would sleep on the sofa he would sleep pretty much anywhere to be honest he wouldn't be bothered he would still be able to go to sleep if it was light outside he wouldn't be bothered really about any noise uh, whereas teddy will not settle unless it's pitch black and there's no noise disturbing him like this is when he's drifting off to sleep you know sometimes when he's asleep when he's asleep we can make like the noise around him like usual but recently he's been getting like really annoyed when he's tired and he can't settle because the, it's too bright or like there's too much noise going on oh and then as soon as i take him upstairs oh he'll settle yeah oh have you got one stuck in your foot so anyway i decided this what? morning he was being what? really unsettled what? is he jumping on your foot i thought let me take him upstairs so he's currently upstairs what? in bed i've got the monitor on we've still got the tommy tippy i can't remember what it's called can't remember what it's called but it's the one that links to your phone so like jimmy he's at work right now he could go onto his tommy tippy app and see teddy on the screen uh and I, it's the same like when i uh with jesse because we use this monitor with jesse when i was on an night out once i was constantly looking at the monitor to see him that's when jesse used to sleep in his own room how lovely i'm kidding you know i all love <laughs> i love go sleeping with him and things but yeah he's been up there for quite a while now now usually his naps the past few weeks weeks week two weeks downstairs have been very short and i think that is purely down to it being too bright and being a little bit too noisy obviously jesse will go up to him and go teddy teddy and try and wake him up on purpose because that's just big brother life isn't it you know he's had a really good sleep up there so i'm hoping to get him into a bit of a routine not any sort of strict one but you know i don't know we'll just see how it goes but anyway he's up there he's been up there quite a while actually let me see when i screenshot the photo i took a screenshot photo to send to jimmy that was at 10 27 so he's been up there nearly an hour how cool is that so yeah we're having some playtime this morning me and jesse whilst teddy is having a nap it's as you can see it's lovely and bright outside and it's making me feel amazing right i am a winter girl through and through give me the snow give me christmas give me the rainy gloomy days i know that it's not for everybody but i personally love the rainy gloomy days sometimes that like, don't get me wrong sometimes when it is like that i can be like oh you know get into a bit of a rut and a bit of a mood i think i'm more like those days when it's when we're transitioning from summer autumn into like the christmasy period i love those kind of days 
but this sun is making me so excited for summer this year i never look forward to summer until it gets to around this point and yeah i'm really looking forward to it this year because we're gonna have us two little boys teddy will probably be on the move at some point during the summer as well uh i'm just really excited are you look, look. what have you done no wow we also guys go to the caravan in two three week two or three week with all our besties and mum and dad so i can't wait for that i am so excited and hopefully the weather is like this uh, but yeah sorry i've not even mentioned these toys I, I bought these from tiktok shop obviously because i am a sucker for tiktok shop i am horrendous is anyone else the same i see a video and i'm like right i'm buying that <laughs> i've got it but these were really cheap uh, i've seen them before on karis and james vlog i think they got them for their for amber because i love watching their vlogs and I saw that a while ago and I thought, whoa, I bet Jessie would like that. And then it popped up on TikTok shop the other day. And I'm pretty sure I paid, I don't know, were they about £3 or something like that? They were really cheap anyway. I think delivery is like £3 something. But still, um, let me just see how much I've gotten for. At the minute, they're currently £3.2p, which is amazing. They're supposed to be £5.49. I think I might have paid £5 for mine. I paid £6.77 in total. That was for that and delivery. And it's basically like just these little pots and then you get all the dinosaurs. Really good quality as well. With the little pincer things. And they've got to just sort out the dinosaurs into the correct colour. Obviously, J Jesse was doing it properly this morning, but now he's just having to play with them, aren't you, with your dinosaurs? And they also do like an animal one and a koala one, so I thought he'd enjoy it, and he is. So that's amazing. I also need to give him his love every toys because I've had the parcel for weeks and i've not even opened it because i've been waiting for the right time to to give him it and he's getting a little bit tired as well but yeah i wasn't planning on vlogging today so i've i don't know i've just decided to whip my camera and just have a have a little day at home with us because you all absolutely loved the 24 hours as a mum of two so thank you so much for all the love on that video and a lot of you have been messaging me saying can you do just more full days at home uh, which I definitely will do and I also mentioned that I would be vlogging every day in March I think I'm going to try and do it guys I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to be able to do it because I'm so behind with my vlogs at the minute I'm terrible I've said in the last vlog as well I am so bad at managing my time I'm just all over the place and sorry if I look a mess I've not even cleansed my face this morning even though I said in, my, in one of my last vlogs that I was having a massive lifestyle change and I was going to do my skincare every morning but I've just not this morning well, I will later on before we go to bed. They're back. Back? Oh, you want to put them back in there? Yeah, we can put that. We can put them back if you want. Do you want to get some more toys out now? Should we put these ones away and get some more ones out? No. No? They're back. Right, okay then. Do you want to open this up then? And then you... No. Oh, Jesse wants to do it. Chuck a puck. Okay. Puck. Chuck a puck? Yeah. Oh, obsessed with ice hockey. Chuck a puck is some at Steelers do. I don't know if any any other ice hockey teams do it. But they do chuck a puck where you buy a puck basically like a not a hard one because that would really hurt if you hit someone. Like a foam puck. And you've got to throw it and try and get it into the middle of the rink and or closest to Steeler Dan's foot or something like that. And whoever's closest wins the money. So um he's saying chuck a puck. I don't know what he's planning on doing. Oh look, show everyone, show everyone what you've done. Bless him, he's put all of his pucks in the oh, tub that it came in. Oh, you chucked them? Cool, I Jesse. Chuck a right, we need to make sure these keep nice and safe, don't we? Because we don't want any going missing. Jimmy is actually finishing work a little bit earlier today as well because he's got a valet that's going to be finishing a bit earlier. So I said, do you want to do something after? I don't know what we're going to be doing. I, I wanted to take on soft play, but then I said I, w I decided to stay at home, so I don't know. Uh, we've not got anything planned for tonight, I don't think, but we've got a nice day planned tomorrow. So I thought, well, I'll either film all today or in a little bit of tomorrow and just see what we get up to. Uh, I'm just doing some washing at the minute, just some housework, some chores, just the usual. I'm trying to keep active a lot and not sit down on the sofa. Because if I sit down on the sofa, oh, it's just told me it's heard a noise. Two seconds. I'll be waking up. It's awake. Isn't that good? Look, he's awake now. Bless him, it's just told me it's heard a noise. Right, I'm going to go get him and he will be ready for a feed as well. Jesse, Teddy's woke up. What? Teddy's woke up from his nap. As soon as I took him up, Jesse oh. went, Teddy, Teddy. Calls him Teddy, it's so cute. Shall mummy go and get him? 
No, I'm upstairs. Oh, you want to go get Teddy? I'm upstairs. Okay, let's go upstairs then. Shall we go and wake him up? Well, he's already awake, but shall we go and get him? Yeah. Yeah, go on then. Do you, are you going to leave your stick down here? No. Okay. I've got it. <laughs> You've got it, I know. You're a good boy, aren't you? Yeah. Okay. Go and get him. Oh. Hello, mister. Uh, Hello. Uh, Have you pushed yourself right to the top of this? Can you see him? Ah. Uh, oh, is the camera falling down? It's okay. Mummy needs to turn it off anyway. Need to turn it off now because he's woke up. Sorry, guys. I need to find out what um, monitor this is because I can't actually remember which one it's called. Hello, Mr. Teddy. Have you woke up now from your sleep? Do you just want to come upstairs to mess about? No. Yeah, you did. Have you got mummy's hairband round your wrist? No. <laughs> Look at that cheeky face. Jesse is getting a haircut tomorrow, finally, because he's gone six no, weeks without one. No, no. What's up? No. You don't want your haircut? You, you're fine getting your haircut. You sit on daddy's knee, don't you? Yeah? Okay, then Teddy, shall we go downstairs? Shall we go downstairs? Yeah, and get you some milk. Yeah? Dunkers first. Good boy. We've got little Teddy here. Hello. You sat on your dummy. Hello. And then oh, I just need to do a bit of a tidy up. Teddy's bottles are everywhere. I need to sterilise them. Um, but yeah. Let's see this. Right, it's time to make tea for tonight. <laughs> I don't know why that took me so long to get out of my mouth. Guys, ignore all my bread here. I don't know why we've got so much stuff. I've just got nowhere to put it. Chicken Masaman curry tonight, which I'm excited for because chicken Masaman curry is one of my favourite things ever. But I don't think it's going to taste similar to the one that I would usually order from Market Kitchen in Barnsley. <laughs> So it'll probably taste very different, but it don't matter. We can give it a try. I've never made it before. So, and I'm doing it in slow cooker because it's nice and easy. It's currently one o'clock, so it'll be ready for five. Jimmy's just rang me. He's not going to be home early anymore, which I'm proper gutted about because I was so looking forward to having him home early. I feel like that's probably why we're in a really good mood this morning as well at sun. Um, but yeah, he's not going to be home early anymore. Feed an onion. Peppers and chicken <laughs> and coconut milk. Oh, and masaman, masaman paste. That would be a good idea, wouldn't it? So yeah, all I've got is three chicken breasts, masaman paste, which I literally just got from Tesco in the Thai section. Uh, Four hundred ml of coconut milk, onion, peppers, and then. Usually in my Saman curry you'd have potatoes as well, but I used all my potatoes the other day for something else I did, so I'm just going to do the chicken today because I don't have the potatoes. And then we've got some rice, um, which we can do later on. So it looks dead easy what she's done. You literally, literally just throw everything in and put it on high for four hours and that's it. I just need to cut up my onions and peppers. Uh, Teddy's just chilling. Jesse is playing with his sticker book. So they're all good whilst I'll do it for literally five minutes and then it's done. Slow cooker meals are honestly top tier. The only thing I hate about them is cleaning the pot out after. It's just a nightmare. Right, so I'm going to cut up my peppers and onions and I'll come back to you. I'm gonna 
add the mass amount paste, I'm just going to eyeball this. I've added the chicken to the peppers and the onions. So I'm just going to try and make it look at how, how much she did. Ooh, that smells strong. Then 400 mils of coconut milk. Oh, wow. I don't think that's right, guys. I think this, has that gone funny? All like dried up at the top. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that. My last coconut milk wasn't. Let's have a look. Oh, oh, wow. Right, I think it's just gone to, I don't know if that's right. It's all like separated. Is that normal? Do I just need to mix it? Right, I've given it a stir and it's fine, I think. But that doesn't look like the coconut milk I had before. It's gone all separated, but if it tastes funny or anything, I don't know. I literally bought it the other day. There we go, all mixed together. And now that's going on for four hours on high. So, I'll give you an update on what it's looking like halfway through, but oof, looking good so far. <laughs> Even though the chicken's raw, so it wouldn't taste nice, but Teddy was getting a little bit grouchy when I was doing that. And now I know why. <laughs> I don't know whether to take him upstairs or not because this little one is playing. Have you ate some of your dinner? You've not had quite a lot of that, have you? Honestly, with, with Jesse and eating, I'm sure lots of your toddlers will be the same if you've got one. Um, what is it? It's your drill, isn't it? You love your drill. We'll have days where Jesse will eat so much and then we'll also... Oh, where's it gone? Oh, it's there, look. We'll also have days where he just barely eats anything at all and I never really pressure him into eating anything so I always think... You know, he can tell me now if he's hungry, we'll always say din din. And so, you know, I'll know that he's hungry or he likes for chocolate or crisps or whatever. Um, so I know right now he's obviously not hungry because he's not touched it. Uh, but that's why sometimes now I don't really put him in the high chair because um, if like he, he will go back and just pick on that throughout the day. I'm leaving it out for him because I guarantee if I took it away, he'd go, no, no, no. You found it, you clever boy. What's my name? Mama. Good boy. You got your drill? Mama, yeah. Mama on. You want it on? Yeah. yeah. Okay. There we go. All done. Yeah? Right, I think I'm going to do some cleaning. Well, I need to do a pause. Um, and yeah, let Teddy have his nap. Let Jesse just have a play. <gasps> are you drilling my coffee table? You're not, are you? Oh, I also need to edit a YouTube video. I need to edit about five YouTube videos, actually. Pick up. I'll put the green one in there. Can you see it? And where's the purple one? Get a purple one. <gasps> Clever Where's boy. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Put it in. Put it in your pincers. Good boy. Now oh, Jesse. Orange, <laughs> orange. No, orange. That's blue. Where's the orange one? Oh, that's green. Orange. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Daddy's home from work. Jesse's showing him his new dinosaur toy. What colour is that? We're just learning some colours. Yellow. Yellow. Yellow, good boy. Yeah, so for the past no, that's wrong. hour and a half, two hours, both boys have been asleep. I finished my CBeebies vlog finally because we went like three, four weeks ago. But there were two corrupted clips in the vlog. I'm so, I was so annoyed. And then I've gone to transfer the farm vlog. Corrupted clip in that as well. I don't know if it's this camera, so I'm like quite scared to film on here now. I mean, I've got another camera, but I do prefer the Sony one. So... I might have to just start using the other one to be safe, just to make sure I've got no corrupted clips. Yeah, the boys have been asleep, so I've just been sorting that whilst they've been asleep. Uh, dinner will be ready in about half an hour. I'll show you how we're getting on. Well, for about an hour, I'd left the lid like half off of the slow cooker because I'm, I, I didn't put it back on right. So, <laughs> but it's okay. It looks, it looks good. It smells amazing, like absolutely gorgeous. I just need to give it a bit of a stir. I'm just not sure that coconut milk's right, guys, because. Can you see? It's like gone all bitty. I'm not sure. Like it ju I just got the one from Tesco in just the can. It was like all like rock hard at the top. 
and then I had to mix it all in. It just looks a bit like bitty. I just don't know if it needs a good a good stir, but it smells unbelievable. So I can't wait for it. So that'll be ready in about half an hour. But I think in this half an hour, especially now that Jimmy's home, I'm gonna crack on with some housework that I've been meaning to do all day and just not got round to doing. Because again, I'm struggling to prioritize my time for stuff. Like, do I do my vlog first because that needs to go up and I've got no other time to do it this week? Or do I do the pots that need doing before dinner? It's just, ugh. So I'm gonna do some housework. Um, power through, get it done now that he's home. They're just both playing in there with the dinosaurs. And Teddy's still fast asleep at the minute. But yeah, my house isn't looking the best at the min. Just got stuff everywhere. Like Jesse's dinner, he barely had any of that to be honest with you. Uh, what? Oh, That's not right. Who did that? Look, Jesse. Jesse did that. Look, Jimmy, we didn't, I didn't get it on film when they first started doing this. Jimmy put one in, a purple one in the yellow one on purpose and Jesse went, oh, <laughs> and took it out. Right, you ready? Right, Daddy's look, turn. Look. Ready, watch. Look, watch. look. What? Look. Hockey hand. Hockey hand? Muck hands. <gasps> Mucky hands. I've cleaned them. Because Daddy's been at work. You ready? Watch, watch. Yeah. <laughs> You're right, Jesse. It should be in that one, shouldn't it? Oh, bless him. Look, green. Green. Good boy. <laughs> Jesse. What colour is it, Jesse? That one. Oh. See, I'm getting distracted now. I've just said I was going to do it else before. Oh, thing. Boy. Let me do it. <laughs> First up is taking all the cardboard stuff out for the blue bin because it was full, it got emptied this morning so I need to take all this out because it's been doing my absolute editing being outside all week. when you've done all the pots and then you go back in the living room and find these. <laughs> right, the curry I have tried. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I tried it about 10 minutes ago and it just tasted so watery. I was like panicked a little bit because <laughs> I want it to be nice. I mean, I'll show you what it looks like. So I have added some other bits into it. So I'll tell you what I've added. Um, I added some garlic granules. I added mixed herbs, a bit of salt. I've added some cornstarch as well to try and thicken it up a little bit because it was just so watery and didn't really taste much. So, I mean, it's looking loads better now actually, but it's pretty much ready. It's all ready, I'm just gonna give it one last try. I think I do prefer the B&M Mayflower curry powder, to be honest with you. Loads better, loads better. Although I do think I could have done with some more Massaman paste. Oh, I ended up adding the full um, tub of that Massaman paste as well. Uh, so now I need to get my naan breads. Where have I seen them? What, what did I do with them? They're here. Just get these ones from Tesco. Uh, garlic and coriander. Jimmy got the Peshwari one last time and he, and he didn't like it. So I just got this for us. I've got two pilau rice, but I wish I would have got jasmine rice because that's more like Thai, isn't it? But it don't matter. Two minutes this one. I'm going to put this one in now and then it could cool down ready for Jesse. I hope Jesse likes it. Hopefully, he will. <laughs> looks really nice um Hi. yeah let's tuck him hi guy oh look at stare at me wow <laughs> right it's a bit later now it's 7 42 um 
Jesse demolished that curry. I'm so shocked. I said to Jimmy, he's not going to eat this. He absolutely loved it. Loved it. What are you messing with? I'm going to have to do this quickly because he will cause havoc behind me. So I've been in the shower. Me's just got in the shower now. Teddy is fast asleep upstairs in bed because, again, he was getting really annoyed downstairs. So I took him up, <laughs> settled straight away. This one, of course, is wide awake. Even though 10 minutes ago, his eyes were nearly shooting on sofa and then he stood up and decided to start playing with ice hockey stuff. So I've just come in here to do my skincare because I've cleansed in the shower like I always do. But, oh my God, I'm running out of whatever these are. I keep forgetting to buy them every time I go out. Right, where's what I'm looking for? Right, so I've cleansed in the shower Hi. with, I can't remember what it's Hi. called, but it, Mommy. it's... Hi, Mummy. It's the vitamin Hi. C cleanser from Temple Spa Mom. and then I'm going in with Glow Colic which is a resurfacing toner and Mom. I love it so much. Guys. I have seen a massive Mom. difference Mom. Morning, in guys. morning guys. It's night time though isn't it? Can you say night guys? Night guys. I have seen a massive difference in my skin since starting Temple Spa. I don't know if I've mentioned it on the vlogs actually. I think I might have only mentioned it on my Instagram so sorry if you've no idea what I'm talking about but basically I um, needed a full new skincare set few weeks ago because I've run out of everything and I've gone back to my roots and used Temple Spa again for the first time in I don't know but I'm still using some Temple Spa bits now but I mean like the cleansers the toners and everything so uh, I've been using that and then I'm using Let's Concentrate which is um a serum as well a skin glowing serum this feels amazing I am looking for a nighttime moisturiser. I'm still using Repose a little bit from Temple Spa at the minute, but I'm also using the Medicaid Retinol. Um, so I tend to just put that on on a night and just leave that on its own to soak in and don't really put anything on afterwards. So yeah, I've just got that on and I have been drinking so much more water since the beginning of the week. I got this from B&M. I just got it for the gym, but I've been using it at home as well because I much prefer drinking out of a straw like bottle then drinking it out of a cup because I find I'd drink more of it um, and it's got the times on and stuff but I don't follow that because I just fill it up whenever but yeah it's fab I think it was about four pound and it's amazing are you ready for bed we're in a, we've changed pajamas now haven't we we've been in pajamas all day and now we've got new pajamas on because we all have been in his pjs don't we yeah <laughs> come here this little boy oh I just love it look at your hair you're so desperate for an haircut, aren't you? Are you getting your haircut tomorrow with Daddy? No. Yes, you are. No. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Do you want some skincare on? No. Do you want some, you want some of this on your face? No. No, yeah, I, yeah. I don't think yeah. so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you can't. Your skin is already beautiful as it is. Look. You don't need to add anything Look. on. Look at you. Look at Your hair's crazy, boy. I feel like Jesse's yeah, hair's getting darker. Oh. He's actually put some of that oh, on his hand. Oh. oh yeah, rub. Yeah, let's go and wash him now then. Yeah? No, 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 no. Right, come on then. Let's go back in here. Do you want to watch some hockey? No, 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 no. Yeah, or do you want to watch a film? <laughs> what do you want to watch? Steelers. Steelers. Yeah. Again. Um, this is just my life 24-7. Who's that? It's Teddy. It's Teddy, isn't it? Oh, man. Uh oh, mummy took mummy help. I found the name of the yeah. monitor. It's called. Oh, it's okay. Is it your look? It's there. It's called Dream Sense Monitor from Tommy Tippy. It actually comes with a little parent pod as well, but I haven't set. You don't have to set that up, but you can. It's like a, it's basically like a little pod, and it'll pop up with like a red mark if there's been a noise or um, if there's been a noise, it'll pop up red. But obviously, you get a notification as well. Um, we did have another Tommy Tippy monitor that was absolutely amazing. What was what? Which one was that called? I've just had a quick look. It's the Tommy Tippy Dreamy monitor. That one was absolutely amazing. It is a little bit pricey, but I would definitely say it's worth the price if you're looking for a baby monitor that you're wanting to use for a good few years. Um, that one comes with like an actual monitor to look at. Um, and in all honesty, I do prefer those kind of monitors, but. Jessie threw the um, monitor in the bath. 
so that one doesn't work anymore unfortunately it was amazing as well it was so good but this one is amazing as well like the obviously there's pros and cons to both but the real thing i like about this one is i can see teddy like if i go out and stuff so um yeah it's really good i'm gonna try and settle this one here uh i'm also gonna edit a video well try to start editing a video i'm trying to keep on top of the videos now because i'm getting really behind with them i've never ever been this behind with videos honestly it's so bad so yeah are we gonna get settled for bed jesse yeah do you want to lie down because <laughs> the thing is you are tired aren't you but you're not going to sleep is that right <laughs> morning everyone it is now saturday so the day after and we've been out for breakfast this morning to jimmy's nan's Mama. haven't we Mama. what have you got chocolate around your mouth what again you have, haven't you? Nan, nan, yeah. You have been to Nanan's, haven't we? For nan, dinner, for yeah. breakfast, sorry. We nicked to Morrison's because uh, I needed to pick some bits up. And now we're home. And then Jesse and Jimmy are going out for the hairs doing soon. And look at all mess behind me. And then when they get home, we're getting ready and we're going out to Supper Club in Elsica. If you're local to me, you'll have probably heard of Supper Club. If you haven't and you live near where I live, you need to go when it's on it's usually the last weekend of every month at elska heritage center called supper club and they have all these different food trucks and drinks and stuff it's really nice and the weather today is really lovely to be honest so we've dropped on nice so we're gonna go there with all my family and jimmy and the boys are coming so that'll be nice so i thought we could get ready together i'm not gonna get ready until these two have left so that i can try and get ready in some sort of peace seeing as my little teddy bear is nice and quiet so uh, my plan was to try and do some housework before I get ready and that is exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to put all this washing away that you've just seen behind me just now because I've got a big old pile to put away so I'm going to crack on with that I think. Do a bit more washing and then everywhere else is pretty much alright because I actually did the pots last night after dinner which made me feel so much better this morning coming down knowing that I'd done the pots. Still going to get dressed as well because I just threw this on this morning. I'm going to do that now. So let me crack on before I procrastinate any longer and carry on talking to you. Try and find more stuff to talk about. I think I might put some washing in first actually and then start putting it all away. But yeah, let's go do some housework and then get ready. Tommy's Jimmy's brother, that's why I've said that. Jimmy and Jesse have gone for their haircuts, but they are running behind, so um, I'm just gonna try and get sorted. Get sorted whilst they're gone. Um, so yeah, let's get ready. all the way through this it's because i'm actually filming a get ready with me for tiktok um i've been meaning to film one for absolutely ages and my, my uh, lights run out every single time i've gone to do it i know i look wet at the minute but it's not it's just because i've used that hmb stuff guys you it, once i've done once you've watched this go and watch the get ready with me and i've linked all the products on there because i am so happy with how my makeup's been looking recently because i bought all these new products and they are absolutely insane i love them so much Right, we're all ready. 
ready to go. I've done my makeup. I've got ready. I've just got a blazer on just to make myself feel a little bit better. Teddy is in a brand new outfit because we had a massive accident, didn't we? So you're in a brand new outfit now. I've packed Jessie a little activity thing. I got this bag from Timo. It was actually part of Teddy's hospital bag. And I've got some colouring books, pencils, that magic water book thing. Um, and a book that he likes with some like little dinosaur things and then just this shark thing that I'm going to take with us. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Also, it's Jessie's first time wearing proper trousers, isn't it? Anyway, all ready to go. We're going to make his way there. Everyone's already there. We're running late, obviously. Um, I could have probably done with putting a bit of blusher down. Uh, blusher? Bit of foundation down here. Uh, but yeah, let's go. I've tied my hair back as well because it's greasy and I've not had time to get it shower and wash it and do all that other stuff, so... Yeah, some I had to sacrifice today and it won me air. Love at first sight when I looked in those eyes all those years ago. Trips to Virginia so Grandma could meet you. To start in a family of our own And that's what happens when you're up from one until four o'clock in the morning. Hi everyone, it's now the next day. Oh, I won't end up waking him up. To be honest, he is due to wake up at any time to be honest. Um, yeah, I think he's getting up now anyway. But he's fell, he fell asleep on the floor, on the carpet, bless him. We're up with Jesse from 1 till 4 o'clock this morning. We got a bath to settle him and everything, but we're all feeling it. We're super duper duper tired. And I've got a horrible headache. <laughs> but it's um, it's Sunday now. We had a lovely night last night. Jesse was just so tired. He fell asleep in the car on the way home. And then stayed asleep until 1 o'clock in the morning. Jimmy has been for a bit of a shop and I've just been doing some housework. I've managed to get through pretty much all of the washing pile, which I'm so happy about. Um, and I've just got this pile of washing to pop away. I have just got the most horrible headache ever. I think it's because I've really, really cut down on the amount of sugar I've been having. Obviously, you know, I'm trying to eat a little bit healthier, so I think my body's, like, thinking, where's my chocolate, where's my sweets? Um, so I've just got a bit of an headache. I've took some tablets, but it's not shifting it. So I'm just editing a vlog currently. Um, and then after the after that, we've, well, we've got no plans basically for for today. So, but I do want to get a shower and wash my hair, um, get both of the boys bathed, even though Jesse got in at half one this morning, and just get ready for a new week tomorrow. So yeah, I think a cosy Sunday is on the cards for us, which I think is very much needed. <laughs> We're just having a crazy ten minutes, aren't we? Well, Jimmy is. Jimmy's having a crazy ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm leaving the mad living room down here and I'm going to get my a shower so I'm going to have 10 minutes to myself 10 minutes peace right anyway I'm going for a shower I can't wait I'm going to wash my hair and everything indulge myself and make myself feel a little bit better I've been lying here for two I don't know what else to do. I wanna get away from every little thing. Done all the to to make it hair. Just, oh, I mean, it don't look bad now, but the amount of hair that was coming out in that bath was unbelievable. And you're probably wondering why I've just got a ball of hair. It's so that the drain doesn't get blocked with all of this. So as it was coming out, I was trying to pick it up and put it on the side of the bath, so I can just put it in the bin instead of it going down but yeah i think postpartum hair loss is a little bit worse than it was with jesse last time with jesse i lost these bits here and i'd seen earlier a little bit i snapped off so yeah and i probably shouldn't be really brushing my hair whilst it's wet but i'm just gonna do a quick brush and then put it back in a clip very gently just in my primark pjs i always get questions about where these pjs are from they're literally primark best pjs ever i love them i've got them in loads of different colors and patterns and i think they're about 15 pound i think they're called boyfriend pajamas uh, but yeah, I'm all done now. It's currently 10 to 6. I'm going to go downstairs and put tea on for the boys. They're having having just like some chicken and some potato lettuces tonight. Much to my delight, we've got Paul come on on. Jimmy is currently really upset because he's just found a TikTok that says... 
Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> it says, which character reminds you of your boyfriend? And I said Mike Rosowski. I don't think he looks like him, but I just feel like he's got the energy of Mike Rosowski, so now he's upset. <laughs> Radiate his energy. What do you mean? <laughs> and then he said, then Jimmy says that I remind him of Russell from Hope. <laughs> well. <laughs> to throw it back at me. Anyway, we've had dinner now. I'm so sorry that last clip probably ended up really short. My uh, memory card ran out of storage. Shock. So anyway, I'm in the PJs. Jimmy's about to get a shower and cry because I think he's Mike Krasowski. And we're gonna watch Saturday Night Takeaway because we missed it last night because we were out. Jesse seems to be settling down, so I hope he's gonna be going to sleep soon. Are you tired, Jesse? Guys, I really wanna decorate for Easter and spring because there's some absolutely stunning stuff in the shops, like next Easter stuff. Wow, absolutely unbelievable. And I do feel like when you decorate for a season, you know, it, it stays with you for years and years and years. Like all my autumn decorations, this will be the third time I've got them out this year. So, I feel like it is a bit of an investment if I uh, do decorate for spring and Easter this year. Not crazy, but you know, maybe get like a nice wreath up. I've seen a lovely wreath in Next to go up on my little nail there. But yeah, we're going to settle down now, aren't we, Jimmy? Are you going to go and get it bath? Yeah, <laughs> it's fell out with me big time. I wanted to get sorted today, like do the washing and stuff, because on Wednesday I'm going to London. I think I've already mentioned this about going to TikTok. I cannot wait, guys. I'm so excited. I've actually ordered a dress tonight because my jeans at the minute are all of them i don't fit into them so last night when i wore those jeans the buttons were undone the entire time and not because i undid them to be comfortable they just wouldn't do up like i cannot do my jeans at all so i just can't wear jeans so i thought let me wear like a nice like just not a fancy dress you know just like a casual swing dress with some tights and some boots so i've ordered a little green dress green never had green dress in my life but it, i'm hoping it's going to be nice it was actually totally out of stock when i saw it originally yesterday and then when jesse got me up at one o'clock this morning i went on and there was one size left um in a size 14 i probably would have gone for a 16 to be honest but i'm just gonna cross my fingers and hope that a size 14 will fit me i doubt it will though but you know a girl can try <laughs> right i'm gonna get jesse sorted in his pjs put his uh, high chair away and then I think we're going to settle down on the sofa. <laughs> oh my god, I'm getting daggers at me right now. Absolute daggers from my mic over here. <laughs> what was the other options, Jimmy? What else did you want me to choose? I just feel like you've got a bit of his energy coming well, through, that's all. You could have picked Lightning McQueen. Oh, maybe. Oh, yeah. I can definitely see a bit of Lightning McQueen in oh you. Oh, which Disney princess. Oh, see, all these are going to be nice, though, because all Disney princesses are lovely. What do you think? None of them. 